Right. When you make a preliminary statement, when you make, make you know, I, I call them preliminary statement. Mm-hmm. Uh, when, 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 and, but opening arguments fine by me. But mm-hmm. when, when you make a preliminary statement, you should be able to distill the essence of your case, I think, to under 500 words. Mm-hmm. Uh, I mean, Albert Einstein uh, once, once said, if you can't explain it simply, then you don't understand it well enough. Right. And that's really the truth. Uh, I, you know, I've, I, I sat through many, many, many trials, and I saw 45 minute, sometimes almost an hour a minute for fender benders that were like, when is this guy ever going to sit down? You know, mm-hmm. his opening argument. And, you know, and then I saw in medical malpractice cases, 15 minute openings. Mm-hmm. And they did a much better job. And you could tell the lawyer who had thought everything through, and you can tell the one that was sort of just floundering. Right. And it's the same same thing with writing. I, you know, no offense to anybody here because you're, mm-hmm. you're not going to hear any names, but God, I read some really bad briefs. Right. Right. What's, and, the, and what's just, the issue? What is the issue here? Yeah. 